Hi guys, welcome back. Now we're on to day three of week three. So like we did the first couple of weeks, we started off with the sway stop and the push recover series. We're gonna be doing the same thing because again, we want to be able to progress you guys accordingly through these motions. So you guys are gonna be in an athletic position. Again, when I say lean to the left, go to the left. When I go to the right, go into the right. Get set, and to the left. Good, back to center, back to the right, back to center, good, relax. So you notice head, shoulders, hips, knees and ankles are in line. They're not rotating their bodies. They're not going too far into the lean. They'll be falling over backwards. Again, right in here, as opposed to rolling out. About five reps each side. Again, just using this to refine our motor patterns for the drills ahead. So now we're gonna be doing the push recovers into the sway stop. For this one, I want you guys to hold that position. The next drill we'll be doing is the push recover into the sprint. So Nate, I'm gonna have you do the push recovers, land in the sway stop, hold it. Sean, on you, I'm gonna have you do the push recovers, land in the sway stop, and sprint out to the 20 yard line, okay? First down, Yep, correct. So Nate, let's have you go first. Again, athletic position, driving off his outside foot, and push, 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 and hold the sway stop. Good, relax. So let's have you do that one more time. So when you do your third one, really try to snap that left leg underneath you a little more quickly. That way we can land in that sway, okay? Get set. And push, push, quickly snap back, push. There you go, relax. So now Sean is gonna be doing the same thing, but sprinting out to the 20 yard line. Yes, that. And push, 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 and sprint. Break down, break down, break down. So break down was not too bad, just overshot it a little bit. It's all good. So you notice on the push recovers, they're trying to maximize how far they're going out to the right. We don't want to take these short choppy steps. Again, really try to maximize our distance each and every time staying low as well. So now we're gonna introduce a lateral lean fall run. Again, this is gonna be a new exercise that a lot of you guys have not done before at all. So you guys will face this direction. Your right knee up, toe up will be up, hands up as well. Then on my go, you're gonna be leaning out to the right and trying to catch yourself and sprint right out. Get set, and start your lean. Drive out, there you go, good. Not too bad, guys. So when we do this drill, we're trying to really effectively push off that outside leg and plant on that right leg as we turn. Like we do with the push recovers, again, we're trying to drive off that outside foot. This is a drill that can help you guys to really maximize that push off as we go into our sprint. So now we're gonna go over the half kneeling open hip sprint into the sprint back. So right knee will be on the ground, you'll be facing that direction. And then from here, again, drive off the outside foot like we did the previous couple drills. For the sake of the video, get to the 10 yard line, then sprint right back to the 20. And what are we doing at the end? Correct. Get set. And go. Drive off, drive off. Yes, there you go. Break down, break down. There you go. Good. Relax, and good correction with your knees on that too as well. You notice they're getting to a good lean before they sprint out. They're not too upright, they're not leaning too far down. They're able to absorb that landing and drive right out of it. Again, these workouts should be taking roughly about 30 minutes to do. And when we do these drills, about anywhere from two to five sets, like assessing your program each direction. Adequate rest every single time. 